Crazy chicken syndrome is one of the diseases that can cause abnormality in the structure of your chickens, in the growth of your chickens, and can even cause lots of harm to your chickens. Can cause reduction in profit for you as a poultry farmer. Some of us are experiencing crazy chicken syndrome, and some of us want to learn on how to fight the crazy chicken syndrome. So if you are in this category, this video is for you. Please watch this video to the end as I'm going to be telling you three things that causes crazy chicken syndrome and how to fight crazy chicken syndrome. Welcome back to the channel again, your number one economic and extension farmer. This channel is all about efficiency, how we can minimize wastage and maximize our profit. We also move outside the box to look for information on how to solve our poultry problem. And if you have any problem, bring it up in this channel. We'll tackle it together. It's a one family channel. So what are the things that are causing crazy chicken syndrome in your chickens? What are the problems? What are the things that has led to crazy chicken in your poultry farm? So number one is untreated disease. If you're having an untreated disease like Newcastle disease, chances are that you are going to be experiencing crazy chicken syndrome. So it is not only the green stool, the feather, and other signs you know that are signs of Newcastle disease. That is only the sign of Newcastle disease. Crazy chicken syndrome can also be a sign of Newcastle disease. It can be that your chickens are telling you that, hi, guy i'm having newcastle disease so if you are having a crazy chicken syndrome in your farm chances are that it is coming from newcastle disease so please treat newcastle disease if you are having a crazy chicken syndrome and what if you treat newcastle disease and you are still experiencing this crazy chicken syndrome this will lead me to number two lack of vitamin e if your chickens are not having vitamin e or enough vitamin e in their system chances are that you are going to be experiencing crazy chicken syndrome in your poultry farm so make sure you fill your chickens with vitamin e and treat them against newcastle disease if your chickens are having crazy chicken syndrome number three is failed vaccine if your chickens are having failed vaccine if you're having failed vaccine or if you administer a failed vaccine to your chicken chances are that you are going to be having a crazy chicken syndrome or turned neck so if the turned neck or crazy chicken syndrome is coming from a failed vaccine i will say you should relax because most of the chickens that are affected with vaccine failure which show the sign or which shows its sign to the crazy chicken syndrome or a turned neck can do well most of the chickens are doing well. They can grow well and still feed normal. So if you're having this crazy chicken syndrome or if your chicken's neck are turned due to failed vaccine, just relax. But make sure you avoid giving your chickens failed vaccines as this can lead to crazy chicken syndrome and other effects in your poultry. To make a recap, if your chickens are having crazy chicken syndrome, Make sure you treat them against Newcastle disease. Make sure you give them vitamin E. And make sure you avoid failed vaccine. If this video has helped you to understand symptoms of crazy chicken syndrome and how to treat it, please subscribe to this channel and like this video. We promise you that we are going to be giving to you our knowledge based on practical experience. If there's anything you want me to talk about in this video, please let me know in the comment box below and I will attend to it. If there's any observation about this channel, also let me know in the comment box below and I will attend to it. Love you guys from Farmers Hub. Bye.